Hi, Tom here again. Hey, uh, before I take this apart and get it ready for um, uh, shipping, I just wanted to show you one more thing. I got the actuators. I moved them closer to the joystick so that you can actually see what happens. And uh, sorry, I apologize here for all the wires, but um, this will give you a good idea of uh, sometimes we don't see uh, both happening at the same time, the actual movement of the joystick versus what's happening aft and below uh, to your gear. So here's a good demonstration. We're already in docking mode. And so when you move the joysticks, as we said before, you can move the joystick forward wherever you move with just a small increments. As you can see, the actuators follow the movements of the joystick. And the steering does the same thing. Wherever you move the joystick, it, it follows precisely. And so when we see this kind of accuracy, uh, I, I like to think of this as called biting into the water, so to speak, if you have a, a water jet and we're controlling that, because it bites into the water so precisely that you have a lot of control with the system, uh, especially the return to spring return to center system. What happens is if you have a uh, system that is uh, controlled uh, by by the joystick with the spring return to center with deflectors it's almost a necessary thing uh, because you know the manual ones when you move back and forth you're not really quite sure where that uh, center uh, buoyancy point is or the balance or the neutral point of that jet so you kind of wander one place or the other and you know jets when you move jet systems and you're driving those they tend to wander a lot at uh, low speeds so this kind of system and especially in the docking mode gives you uh, pinpoint accuracy and and uh, precise movements. Now, had this system been a uh, controlling a prop boat, uh, what it will do is the joystick itself, if you move it so many degrees before or aft of a neutral position, it goes into gear, and then the further you move the joystick, the, it increases or ramps up the throttle or throttles, uh, depending on if you have a single, tw uh, single uh, twin or triple screw uh, vessel. And side to side usually controls the bow thruster, and of course the steering is proportional, it's the same as this way. So there's just a little bit more information um, before we shut down. Thank you.